By design, Valentine's Day is the most romantic day of the year, other than possibly your wedding day. Polk County Clerk of Courts, Stacy Butterfield, is offering couples a chance to double their pleasure by performing a group Valentine's Day wedding ceremony on the steps of the Polk County History Center. Joining us in studio today to talk about the event is Clerk of Courts Stacy Butterfield and Monica Robles with the Clerk's Office. Thanks for joining us today, ladies. Tell us about this event and why you're doing it. Besides the fact that I love Valentine's Day, Cupid and balloons and chocolate, um, you know, on Valentine's Day, it's just a very romantic day. And, and this year, Valentine's Day is Saturday, February 14th, and we are hosting a group wedding for couples at noon at the Polk County History Center. We um, have the ceremony taking place on the steps of the historic courthouse. It's just beautiful, the backdrop and the setting. And it will feature a poem reading by the Honorable Judge Mary Catherine Green, musical serenades by the Harrison Performing Arts students, as well as um, I will provide, pre preside over the ceremony. After the ceremony, we will treat the couples and their guests to a reception in the 1926 vintage courtroom there in the History Center. And we are waiving the $30 ceremony fee that day. However, all of the standard marriage license fees do apply. And the ceremony, because of space, we are limiting it to the first 30 couples that sign up with us. Um, as the clerk of the courts, Taylor, I'm responsible for issuing marriage license in Polk County. And every day we have couples come through our office and ask for a marriage license. Some ask for a ceremony, but this particular event, which this is our second year, last year was our inaugural year, and um, it's just so much fun to be able to host this event. And we're able to do so because we have sponsors so that we can provide the reception and all of the treats and all that we do. So we look forward to a very successful ceremony again this year. Monica, talk to us about the waiting period involved, who it applies to, and also the fees involved in the marriage license application. If you're a resident of the state of Florida, there's a three-day waiting period. Um, you would have to come in by February the 11th in order to participate in our Valentine's Day ceremony. If you're not a resident of the state of Florida, you need to come in by Friday the 13th in order to apply because the three-day waiting period is waived for out-of-state um, weddings. If you want to waive that three-day waiting period, we do have premarital courses listed on our website, which is www.polkcountyclerk.net. If, if you do have the premarital course, the license is only $61, and that is cash or credit. If you do not, then the license is $93.50. Talk to us about the basics of the reception. Um, you know, what couples have to look forward to? Well, Taylor, you know, the world that we live in just moves so quickly and everything that we do, sometimes we forget to just stop and savor the moment. So we want to make sure that the couples have an opportunity to just really cherish the moment and have a lasting memory. So after the ceremony, the couples are invited and their guests to join us in the vintage 1926 courtroom where we'll have a reception with light refreshments, cake and punch. And we'll also have a, um, opportunity for them to have pictures made and those pictures will be able to uh, send to the couples if they so choose and that way they'll have a, a lasting memory of their very special day. Um, we have a number of sponsors that make it possible to uh, provide and offer this event. Um, they include Simple Elegance Wedding and Event Planners, Citizens Bank and Trust, Community Southern Bank, Center State Bank, Publix and Walmart and we're very appreciative of our sponsors because without them we could not have this event. Now is there anything else we should know about the wedding? What to wear, embellishments uh, couples can bring, any of those fine details to knock out of the way? Absolutely. Each couple they need to make this day their very own. If they want those embellishments, if they want boutonnieres, if they want bouquets, if they want um, a veil for the brides, whatever they choose, they're welcome to bring and use in the ceremony. Of course, it's not required, but it's up to them if they'd like that, if they want to bring a bouquet for the bride, um, any of those types of items they're welcome to bring for the ceremony. Um, again, we just want it to be something that they can remember. Everybody's wedding day 
whether it's going to be on Valentine's Day or some other day or if it's wherever it's at, you want it to be special sure. and you want to remember it forever. So whatever it, it is for that particular couple that will help them celebrate their special day and make it a, a, a lasting memory, please, please go ahead and, and bring whatever you'd like. Um, our inaugural wedding last year was a huge success. Uh, we had a lot of fun. Our yeah. staff members that participated, which um, we couldn't have done it without them, uh, just spent a lot of time planning and it was, it was just a lot of fun to see everyone. And so we look forward to doing it again this year. And um, we invite the community to come down and watch. The steps are outside and there's a lot of area on the grass that we have plenty mm -hmm. of room for um, people to come and observe and watch. The couples don't mind. As a matter of fact, you know, it kind of makes it, we have a processional where the couples come in and the music that plays and it, it just, it's amazing when you look out and they were, just had big smiles on their face. So um, if you're not able to come and watch the ceremony, we will post pictures on our Facebook. Please like us on our Facebook page. And we just look forward to a really special day on February 14th. All right, Clerk Butterfield and Monica, thank you for joining us today to tell us about the Valentine's Day group wedding. It's my pleasure. No problem. Well, if you've been struck by Cupid's arrow and you're ready to tie the knot, head over to the clerk's office to reserve your spot in the Valentine's Day group wedding. Additional details are available on their website at www.polkcountyclerk.net or by calling 863-534-4000.